Oh, hey, we are going to the Goodwill bins for the first time in months. How long has it been? Months, yeah. It's probably been, I don't know, a month and a half. Last time we were here, they were only doing rotations every two hours, and I'm seeing a bunch of people leaving as we're pulling up. So we might be in this weird spot where we have to wait two hours for a rotation, which doesn't sound fun. Bad carpenters, Johnny Cash. One of these days I'm gonna get lucky like some people I've known and just find the bag full of Nirvana and other stuff. That's not bad, I'm, I'm definitely getting the bag. I don't know about the tapes yet. Ooh, Big Floyd. Damn, missing his head and his club. Star Wars. Find of the century. Holy crap. It's an acrylic Tweety clipboard. And look at this tiny leaf blower. This is for you, Ivan. Hospital kitties. You gonna get them? They're compression socks, so they'll hurt my feet. But oh. They're really cute. I kind of want them. It looks big enough. Looks like I'm. Where's the football game? I look like I'm five minutes late to my daughter's soccer soccer practice. Oh yeah, I found one more thing of interest. Press, press the button. Ask Press me it. a question first. Do you like me? No! <laughs> you want to see my best thing? What's your best thing? <laughs> uh, that's pretty awesome. Yeah, that's my... My shop notes are going to go on this in the <laughs> shop. Hey, grab a hook right here on my pegboard. That's real cute. I found you one lonely rat's food. I tried to find the other. It's a hard life out there, man. This is probably the best thing I've ever found. I love that. One bag of Lego and the biggest plasticky, flimsiest kind of crap, but awesome frisbee I've ever seen. Can and jam. Canjam.com. Can jam. Oh, this is going to be a banjo strap. Okay. If it's big enough. But they look very big. Dang, well, what are the chances that I find the other one? Honestly, I'd buy them if they had their sleeves, but they're not really worth five, six bucks a piece. It's cool though. It's crazy they're both here. Imagine this Christmas tree in the shop. It's only 80 bucks, but that's not getting me a smart car, especially with these two rugs. Just imagine though, imagine the ornaments I could put on there. What I can do and will do is strap these bad boys to the roof if I have to, but I'd really rather not. It's way more comfortable ride if you don't do that. The question is, are they gonna fold? If they fold well, cram we can. You just gotta show the rug who's boss. Muscles McGee. <laughs> Surely that's not good for the rug. We got any rug experts? Don't tell them. I'm sure somebody will let me know. I'm sure if it were gonna be like this for days and weeks, it would not be ideal. This one's a little thicker. Don't 
Donkey kick it. <laughs> It's a horse kick when you kick it as hard as you can. It's donkey kick when you give it a little kick. <laughs> I had to think about that when I was like, well, I've been kicked by a horse. I ain't never been kicked by a donkey. <laughs> I've been kicked by a horse several times. Oh, it's threshold. I didn't know that. Thanks. Okay. Now we gotta, I think. Rip. Now I think we gotta put the rest in from up front. I don't think the, this golf bags might be going in your lap. What's the damage? Oh no. We're crunched. I'm oh, fine. Good? I'm Gucci. Well, you still got to carry some things in your lap, but okay. let me get rid of the cart. Oh yeah, the best thing that I bought. No! Okay, we will for sure talk about this a little bit more when we get back to the shop but initial thoughts not having been here in a couple months go it's good that's all you got i mean it's different now because like i'm looking for different things so it's yeah it's fine i hadn't even thought about that honestly it's way different because we're not shopping so much for resale etc as we were before my two things that come to mind first way more people in there than i've ever seen yeah it was busy so busy uh second thing even with two months away, it doesn't sting any less when you see someone get something you really wanted. I saw a guy found a Dark Magician Yu-Gi-Oh toy. Aww. Oh, I was like, oh, so dope. Happy for him though. Yeah. And then another guy found a super vintage microphone Dang it. that I would have loved to have to have actually used, but. Uh, somebody found a vintage, like hexagon quilt. If you know it, you know it. It was beautiful, but you know, it's fine. He can have it and he can sell it. I almost walked up and was like, how much are you selling? <laughs> right. I thought about doing the same to the Dark Magician guy. I'm, I have $15 cash in my wallet. I'm sure he would have taken it. <laughs> he probably would have. I don't, like, sure, dude. I'm sure it's not even quite worth that. It's not like it was in box or anything. Yeah. Uh, all right. Let's go back to the shop. All right. We're back at the shop. I'm a little bit nervous about this, but let's see how the rugs fared. I don't guess they look too bad about it. <laughs> yeah, they don't look bad. I don't know, I've not owned a lot of rugs in my life. Where's my disc golf basket, hold on. I'm out of breath. <laughs> Run, man. I gotta get lower. Oh. Okay. It's hard to explain how a smart car smells from the back when you open it up, because the motor's right here. And uh, this thing's been cooking for two hours straight home. So there's a little twingy, burny smell. All right, one more rug rescue this is the one that really got in there oh. one more try gotta get low gotta aim left okay uh let's go inside and talk about what we got real quick All right, let's talk about the stuff that we got. Honestly, the rugs for me were the big thing. Uh, you guys have seen me bring rugs recently back from the Goodwill Bins, well recently, a few months back. I could still use two or three more. About every room we have, our office is here, our bedroom and middle room at home, and even our hallway could use a nice rug, so I might actually push for going back there again next week, just so we can see if they have more rugs. Uh, Hannah, you tell them about something you got. 
I'm gonna go ahead and hang Tweety Bird up on my pegboard. Um, I got this uh, nice scrap bit of fabric. It's all cotton um, quilting fabric for my mom. It's very pretty. I got two bag straps. Uh, you know, banjos don't have nuts on them, right? They've got clips. So this is still a little small, but something colorful. So I bought two of them just in case. Because the one I've been using, I got off of another bag that needs to go back on. What else did you get? I got three vintage scarves that I'm going to use for my hair. Like, like headbands and such. I've been doing a lot of hair scarves lately, so I'm pretty excited about these. This is this one, and this one, and this one. This one's probably my favorite, though. That is nice. She's pretty. I got a vintage Baywatch. Uh, sea do what do you call this? ski do hmm. Ski Jet ski. Jet, yeah, that'd be better. But yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess it came with like a Barbie-like figure. I don't know. Comment below if you do know. But it's probably five, ten bucks on eBay if I wanted to go that route. It also is yellow, so I couldn't leave it behind. Lego. I have a growing Morocco collection. It's by far the smallest shaker and or Morocco that I have. It sounds like there's a singular bead. There is. That's all. Um, and also an 18 dart Nerf clip. And one of these Polaroid cameras, which I actually have some film for, and a couple different of these cameras. So that's more hobby stuff for me. Show them what else you got. I gotta get one more thing out of the car. Got this beautiful Western style belt, which is really cool. It like clasps around and you loop it through this bottom belt loop. And then this top lip belt loop, it goes through. And then you have this like decorative outer piece that's like cinched in. I love it. It's a little too small for me right now, so I may either sell it on Depop or gift it or something. Or hold on to it because I'm a hoarder. I don't know what this is. It came up on Lowe's website for like 25 bucks, so it's just a weird premium for whoever, whoever likes this uh, Husavarna brand. Husavarna? I don't know. I couldn't leave. It's one of those things, miniature stuff shows up at the bins. I can't leave it. Uh, Nope. Not even, not, not even close. Oh, and then I also got this. Uh, it's just, I actually, it had cassettes in it and they fit in there perfectly, but it also feels like this could just be a bag for one of those Sony Walkman. But it's got that vintage Sony thing going on, which I'm a big fan of. To be honest, I didn't read Sony. My brain said saw Igloo. And so I'm like, oh. Igloo? Oh, like, <laughs> like, yeah, I got you. Uh, that's probably my favorite thing I found, actually. I have a Sony Walkman of my own. I might just keep it in there, put a couple tapes in there with it. I do not have good luck at finding great cassette tapes though, ever. Yeah, they're always just like the garbage well, stuff. It's always everyone else that I see. I get left out. Everyone else gets good tapes. Uh, you guys comment below and let us know what your favorite thing that we found today was. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Turn those notifications on. Uh, I don't suppose you need to see the rugs really. You kind of saw them at the thrift store, but uh, subscribe, turn those notifications on for future videos because I'll probably be making a video laying those out where they're going. We need probably one of them at home, one of them in our podcast area. I don't know. We'll see. But uh, come back next time to find out. Until next time, guys, peace out.